Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome to Headstrong. My name is Lane, and this is a Madden 18 realistic rebuild of the Buffalo Bills. As you know, the Bills got knocked out of the playoffs by the Jaguars 10 to 3, which is just atrocious. The Bills are even lucky to get into the playoffs, not to mention they play in the Patriots division and all that. So we're going to have to get a better quarterback, some better wide receivers, just pretty much a better team overall. If you haven't checked out a rebuild before, though, I sim three or four seasons. I make some trades. I draft some players. I scout some players, free agents, all that. But as realistic as I can do, I'm not going to make some trades yet like Aaron Rodgers or Tom Brady. That wouldn't happen in real life, so that's not going to happen now. So let's hop in and check out our team real quick, see if we can do any trades or anything before the season. So I am using the active roster for the Buffalo Bills. So we have Tyrod Taylor at quarterback, who I'm going to have to get rid of ASAP. LaShawn McCoy at running back, obviously that's good. Calvin Benjamin, Jordan Matthews, wide receivers, not too bad. I was expecting a little bit more out of Matthews this season, but I mean, you're on the Bills. What can you really expect? Then we got Charles Clay and Nick O'Leary at tight end, which is that's very, very good. Our offensive line doesn't look too, too bad. I might try to get rid of Incognito because I believe he's a little bit on the older side. Yeah, 34. And players start regressing at about 30, 31, but apparently, eh. I mean, I guess we haven't started simming or anything like that. So he has got a, a decent amount of XP. On defense, though, this is where we're going to need a lot of work. Obviously, we got Jerry Hughes. We have White as those two A's right there. Uh, Kyle Williams a little bit on the older side, I believe. Also, yeah, 34. In real life, he's debating retiring. I don't know if he's going to. Our, our left end isn't very good. G Gaines isn't too, too bad, but I'm not, I don't really know too much about him. 25, so yeah, we're probably going to keep him. Our linebackers need a lot of work and our safety. I know Hyde. Hyde had a great, great season, so we're obviously going to keep him. We don't really need to look at our special teams or anything like that. Practice squad. So what I want to do, let's go to offense. I'm going to try to trade Tyrod Taylor and Richie Incognito. See if I can get some sort of draft picks for them or something along those lines. Because we're obviously still playing in the AFC East. So we're really not going to... If, if we get into the playoffs, it's going to be a wild card spot. So I'm going to try to trade those players. Let's see. What is Jerry Hughes for age-wise? 29. So he's like right before you start regressing. I don't know if that's a good idea or not. Let's see White. He's 22. Okay, yeah. So you're going to stay on the team. So let's see what I can do for trades. I, I want to get some linebackers, some draft picks. Actually, I want to go to offense. I, I don't know what else we really need. LaShawn McCoy might be on... How old is he? He's 29 too. So, ugh. See, I don't think I want to trade him. But we'll see what happens. I'm going to mess around with the trades for a second. I'll see you in one second. So for our first trade, I'm trading Taylor and Glenn for the number one pick of the Denver Broncos this year. They needed a quarterback. They wanted a tackle. So I thought that was a good trade. I wanted to get rid of Taylor. We have Peterman as a backup. He's not very good whatsoever. If you guys watch football at all, you know he threw five interceptions in one half of football when Taylor got benched for him, which is just a terrible idea. So hopefully we can... Not have the best year and then get a good draft pick and then draft a quarterback high that hopefully can lead our team to the playoffs. So let's try to make a few more trades. See you in one second. So I'm trading Richie Incognito right in our third round draft pick for the Buccaneers first round draft pick this year. I wanted to get rid of Incognito. Obviously, he's a little bit older. He's kind of a little bit of an asshole. I don't really like him that much. They needed a cornerback that I gave him my third round pick. I'm going to see what other trades I can do. See you in one second. So this is going to seem like a weird trade, but I'm getting rid of Kyle Williams for the Patriots fifth round pick this year. I just wanted to get him off the team before he retires or anything like that. And we got a fifth round draft pick. Hopefully we can get some players to build up our team. So I felt like we probably should have done a few more trades. I thought about getting rid of McCoy, but there wasn't really anything that I wanted to do there. But other than that, we are going to sim right to the midseason mark. Do some scouting. Let's not do that. Midseason mark. Yeah, we're going to do some scouting. See if there's a good quarterback, maybe some good cornerbacks defensive ends anything like that linebackers we just need a good team a good draft so somehow at week nine we are four and three i don't know what that puts us in our division we're in first place in our division i guess technically somewhat tied with the new england patriots that's kind of unbelievable can i see the stats real quick what is peterman doing uh player stats nine passing touchdowns six interceptions so that's not good mccoy has four touchdowns tolbert has seven what who do we have for touchdowns? Benjamin has four. Clay has seven. Whoa, uh, Matthews, Holmes, O'Leary. I like Nick O'Leary. I thought about getting rid of Charles Clay, but I just decided he's 29. He's a pretty good player, so I wasn't going to do that. Let's see what we can scout, though. Scout college players. Please have a good quarterback up here. Oh, yes, they do. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, is that how you do this? Okay, so let's see. We need a quarterback, obviously. So throwing throwing the run, not bad. Throw power. Throw, okay, that's pretty good. But a late second rounder. Wow. Oh, there's another quarterback right under him. Maybe this guy will be a little bit better. Throw power, A-minus. 
Accuracy short B plus. Ooh, I like that. What is he? 6-3 out of Georgia? Not too bad. Let's see what else? We do we need a, a strong safety? Not so much. We do need a tackle, but actually we have three first round picks, so. B plus impact block, B pass block, C plus run block. Okay, I'm gonna look around, see what exactly what I need. I will show you guys who I who I scouted and all that. So obviously we need a middle linebacker, so I looked at Collins. B hit power, B pursuit, B tackle, an early first rounder, six feet out of Oregon. Might have to take a look at him, but let's see what else we can see. So obviously LaShawn McCoy is getting up there in age. About 30 is when you start regressing. So we're gonna look at Antonio Hughes. A minus stiff arm, A minus carry, B plus trucking. That is not too bad out of Alabama. Obviously, they just won the national title. So let's add him to our, oh, he's already on our draft board? No, no, add to our draft board. So I'm trying to just get a good linebacker squad. So we're looking at another middle linebacker, Burnett. B plus hit power, B plus tackle, B plus pursuit. Better than the last guy we looked at. So let's add him to our board, Texas A&M. So obviously, we need a quarterback. So we're looking at this quarterback right here. B plus all across the board, throw on run, throw power, accuracy short, a late first rounder. We're going to have three first round picks, so that is good. Let's add him to our draft board. So we're checking out one more center, Summers. B plus impact block, B minus run block, C pass block. Not too good. I'll add him to my draft board for now. Obviously, I'm just looking at first rounders for right now. Then when you get your, your scouting points before the draft, I will look more into the second rounders, the third rounders, stuff like that. But I think we can do one more. So let's check out Curtis Waters. Ooh, a late first round of B plus catching, B route running, and B minus catching traffic. That's not too bad. But Florida State, 5'9". I mean, we have some pretty good wide receivers. But let's sim to the playoffs, see if we make it. Oh, wait, 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 wait. We have to negotiate contracts. Now, Gaines, 25 years old. Jordan Matthews, I want to keep. Mike Tolbert, I might just keep just because he's having a great season. I don't know what he's really going to want. What do you want? Oh, one year, 1.5 million. Yeah. Welcome back as long as you'll take it. Okay, thank you. Now, let's look at what Gaines wants real quick. Four years, 5.7 million. He's 25, normal progression. He's not doing too, too bad. So, let's see if he'll take this contract. That's a good offer. Okay, we got the deal done. And Jordan Matthews. He has so much potential. When he was on the Eagles, he had a hell of a season, and then they traded him. I, I didn't really understand it. I would like to bring him back, though, especially for this price. Let's bring him up to 3.5, see if he'll take it. Yes. Everything else, though, I'll, I'll worry about him later. We're, we're obviously going to draft uh, linebackers in the draft, so we don't have to worry about that. Nick O'Leary. Okay, hold up. I do want you because I, I see a lot of potential in Nick O'Leary. That offer is perfect. Thank you. Everything else, though, I think we're good to go. Yeah, let's sim to the playoffs, see if we make it. We didn't end up making the playoffs? How? So we were 4-3 and three at week 9, and then we ended up 6-8. and eight. So we won two games. Well, 6-8-1. and one. So we won two games, lost five, and then tied? Are you kidding me? What? Did, what did, nope, that's not what I want to look at. I want to look at the stats real quick. Nope, I just clicked on the same thing. Stop it! Okay, here we go. Stats. What did Peterman do? He had nine, so he got 10 for the rest of the season, 13 interceptions. So he had more interceptions the rest of the year than touchdowns? I believe. McCoy had 11 touchdowns. Tol Tolbert had 11. Jones had three. Not, I don't really know who that is. Matthews had three touchdowns. Glad we re-signed him. Kelvin Benjamin almost had 1,000 yards, six touchdowns. Charles Clay, five touchdowns. O'Leary didn't do much more. I might have to trade Charles Clay before the beginning of next season. All right, let's see what the awards are real quick. Yearly awards. Who won the MVP? MVP, Phillip Rivers? Really? Really? Coach of the year. Did we get it? Probably not. We're not even on there. I don't know why we would be. Uh, let's go to, what are we in the AFC? So offensive player of the year. Do we have any guys? No, we don't. Defensive player of the year. Are we on here? We are not. Offensive rookie of the year. Peterman? Don't know how the hell you're up there. I didn't even really, I didn't realize he was a rookie. I thought it was the second year. Oh, we had two guys on defense though. Not, oh, three guys. Okay, so we have a good defense developing. Is that what I'm trying to understand here? I don't really want to look at best QB or anything like that. Now, let's see. See, we don't have that much XP, but we got a little bit of XP, so I am going to use this right now. I'll see you in one second. So the Pittsburgh Steelers beat the Philadelphia Eagles in the Super Bowl. That's something that could happen in real life. Let's see who played in the conference. Steelers, Chiefs, that can't happen. Eagles, Falcons, that can't happen either because they're playing this week. I'm recording this before the divisional round. Divisional, Patriots lost to the Chiefs 42-10. to 10. What happened? Yeah, I mean, this is somewhat realistic. Divisional round, Steelers are playing the Jaguars. Patriots should have played the Chiefs. 
Rams probably should have played the Eagles if I'm being completely honest with you. So this isn't completely off. So we have a final chance to re-sign our players. I don't think there's anybody I really want to get, but I will check it out real quick. Yeah, I don't think so. I don't I don't really want him. Uh, maybe we should just in case, but I probably can re-sign him if not. Uh, yeah, let's see. what can we throw this guy just in case? Yeah, that's not too bad. So let's just toss him that. Yeah, there we go. Do we have anybody else? Normal development. See, this guy also had quick development. I didn't even see that. Slow, slow, slow. Normal, 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 normal. No one else I really want to see. So, let's see who are going to be free agents. I know that, like, Bell can be a free agent. Breeze can be a free agent. I'm not going to... I mean, no, Bell wouldn't make sense because I have McCoy. So, yeah, let's see who we can get right now. Drew Breeze, that wouldn't really make sense. Does anybody just make sense? McCoy, I could also get McKinnon and just cut McCoy, but I don't really want to do that. Wolf wouldn't be a bad choice. Cameron Braid, obviously, we're not going to do that. Lynch wouldn't be a bad choice either. Who is, who's younger? So we probably should get Lynch. Oh, Grimes is 35? No way. Collins wouldn't be bad, but also obviously, we have McCoy, so we don't really need to do that. There's nobody that jumps out at me. Adrian Peterson? Okay, I think I'm going to offer Lynch a contract. Let's give him three years, three million. See if that will even... That doesn't even get above it. So, yeah, let's withdraw that real quick. Let's offer him three years, four million. Normal, though. Actually, let's check out... Is Wolf a quicker? No, he's going down, though. Yeah, let's toss him three years, 3.7. Okay, that puts us in the lead. Okay. But other than that, I don't really see anybody else. Breeze, I mean... No, because we'll probably get one in the draft. I would have to assume. But do I get Breeze just to play it safe? Probably not. That's not really... Yeah, I mean, is that realistic? Would the Bills go for Drew Breeze if he was an option? I don't really know. Let's actually... Can I look at the standings real quick before we make any more decisions? Now, who do we get? We got the Broncos, the Buccaneers, and obviously we have our own. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. No way. Okay, so we are going to have probably the third round pick, the fifth round, sixth round pick, and then the, like, the 10th or 11th. Oh, yeah, okay. Okay, we do not need to get Drew Brees. We are definitely going to draft some sort of quarterback. What did that say? Lugden, who is that? <laughs> I don't know who that is. All right, let's go to stage two, see if we get Lynch. I imagine he'll, he'll sign with us. We gave him the best contract, the best offer, so we'll see. So now that we have, we're like in the free agent part of the game, we can actually see the combine grades for everybody. So this is a quarterback, a second rounder. And look at his, his combine report. He's second and third in everything other than the bench press. And I don't need a strong quarterback. Oh, okay. Add him. We have to remember his name, White. Okay, let's add him to our draft board. I might wait to second round. Yeah, do we, yeah, we have at least one second round draft pick. I hope we don't have to reach. That would be very, very bad. Let's see what this guy's all about. Lucky late second rounder. I don't have many second round picks. So actually, let's go a little bit deeper into the draft. I don't think we have a third round pick. I believe we traded that to the the Buccaneers, maybe something along those lines. So let's see if there's any fourth round guys that tickles our fancy. There's no quarterbacks or anything this late into the draft. Yeah, he's nothing right there. I'm going to see what this guy's all about. Yeah, let's add him to our draft board. All right, I'm going to look around a little bit more. I'll see you in one second. What? Lynch denied our contract offer. Uh, I hope the other guy's still here. Wolf, I'm sure he's not going to want to be on my team now. Yeah, we totally missed out on him. So we're going to get absolutely nobody. Great. Here is our moment of truth. We need to get some good draft picks right here, right now. So what do we have? Like I said, the third, the sixth, and I believe after that it was the, the tenth. Yeah, okay. Is that what else do we have? I don't think I really traded for anything else in the first round at least. No, we did not. So let's pause this draft because I do not like that. Let's go to our next user pick. So Maddie was picked. Uh, I don't think. Let's actually see what we. I forget what we were even looking at. I don't think there was any quarterbacks or anything like that. Let's see what Collins got for. Ooh, third. I remember we were looking at Collins a little bit. We were also looking at Baird. Oh, and he's got some good. Okay, okay, okay. Now let's look at Ingram real quick. I don't know if that'll be a bad pick this early in the draft. I think what we're going to try to do, could we move back a pick or two to the Browns maybe? They got the first and fourth pick in this too. That's kind of funny, but not the way that they did in real life. Let's review the offers real quick. 
The Browns, they're offering me a pick next year. I'd really like your pick this year, buddy. Oh, that, that's kind of really good. I, see, I think that's what we're going to do. We got to pick next year. We got to pick now. Yeah, that's what we're going to do because there's nobody I want to pick this early. So let's go to our sixth pick real quick. Oh, you would. You would pick Collins. Oh, man. I'm going to regret that so much. I can already tell. All right, let's go. I'm going to go with this guy right here, Baird. I don't think there's anybody else. Burnett. Oh, Burnett's a little bit better. Okay, so maybe that was actually a good pick. So let's pick Baird right here. Did we reach superstar development? That's exactly what we want. Yes. Okay, then what do we have? The 10th and 11th pick? All right, all right, all right, all right. Do we do we trade up? See, I don't know if we need to trade up for that other guy. Okay, good, 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 good. There's a, there's a quarterback you guys saw that I want in the second round, so I think that's what I'm going to try to get. I think I'm going to take this guy right now. It says mid-first rounder, but look at those combine reports. It's so hard to pass up, so I'm not going to. Quick development, a little early, but so, so what? I mean, what, what, what are you going to do about it? Now, is there anybody else I really wanted to get? Maybe a right end, but we have Jerry. No, 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 no. I hit A twice. God damn it. I can't believe I just did that. I'm so dumb. Is my quarterback that I want here James White? I mean, I think we have to pick him here if we're going to want him. Beth Cookman, where is that even a college? I'm taking him. So be it. Quick development. I reached a little bit, but I don't have a pick for a while now. So I, I like that pick. He's going to be our starting quarterback. I like the what we're doing so far, other than that right end. But, I mean, what, what can I do there, really? Why do we have another pick right now? Oh. Oh. Why do we have the 29th pick? I don't remember why that happened. I honestly don't know why that happened. Oh, maybe because we already had the Eagles pick? Oh, so we didn't reach that, bar, like that bad, at least in my opinion. So we're in the second round. Who else did I really look at? I looked at some guards. I looked at a center, but that's a little bit too early for a center. I'm wondering if we should just take that. We already we drafted one of these, right? Yeah, we did. Um, that guy looks good, though. That guy looks good. Uh, right outside linebacker is what we need. I like this guy, but that's obviously we're not going to pick him in the second round. Let's see what we have for all positions. I kind of like this guy. Look at that. A minus stiff arm, A minus carry, B plus trucking. 21 years old out of Alabama. We have Tolbert that we brought back. We could always trade McCoy if we needed to. See, I didn't get to look at this guy, but there's just something about him that I, I like it. I can't explain it, but I like it. Uh, let's see, do I go with the known quantity that we have right there? Or do we take a risk? I'm more of a power back kind of guy, so I'm going to take this guy. It might be a little bit of a risk. He was ranked four. We got him at 42, so that's not too bad. Normal development, though. That's not exactly what we wanted. Our next pick is in the fourth round. I don't even know what's going to be here. Let's look at our draft board. Ooh, we do need a right outside linebacker, so I think we're going to take this guy. 23 out of Wake Forest. He doesn't have the best combine. Maybe not the top three skills, but I, just, I have a feeling. 70 overall. I reached? Really? I, I feel like my first few picks were really good, and now they're just kind of like going off a little bit. So we're in round five. Let's look at our draft board again. It's so obviously way too early to get these guys. I, I wouldn't even mind taking a risk on that guy just to see like what he's going to turn out to be. But we're not going to do that. So let's go to available. Did I take a right outside linebacker? I did. We need an offensive tackle who I believe I didn't scout any, really. So what are we going to do here? What do we need? Maybe a center. I did look at some centers. I know that. Vertical jump for my center. Woohoo! Broad jump. I think what I'm going to do is take this guy. I know broad jump doesn't really matter at all. Okay, I don't think you get many quick developments or superstar developments this late in the draft. If you do, I'd be very surprised. You guys should definitely let me know. This is probably the Patriots pick, if I remember correctly. Now, who I do want to go at is this guy. Eh, no, not that guy. Was it this guy? There was a wide receiver. Let's go to wide receiver. There was one that I was looking at. I forget who it was, though. I don't think I... I, did, I was I, I didn't have enough points. I believe that's what it was. So what we're going to do is this guy was supposed to go in the third round. So we're going to take a risk. See what happens. A good pick, obviously, just because they projected him in the third round. That doesn't mean much. So we are in the sixth round. We're going to take this right guard. He's the first in vertical jump. I got some tall jumpers on my team. An excellent pick. He was ranked 65. I got him at 170. Normal development. But like I said, we're not going to get superstar development or anything this late in the game. And our seventh round pick, I almost kind of just want to trade it, but I'm not going to. Is there anybody left on my draft board that I was looking at? There is. 
See, this is where I'm... This is where I might just take him. Just, just because there's something about him. Look at those top three skills. Not too bad. I'm going to take him. Excellent pick. Quick development. Ah, oh, I had a feeling. So I guess you can get quick development this late in the draft. I don't think we have any more picks. We do not. So let's see what our, our roster looks like shaping up to be. Maybe we'll trade McCoy. Maybe we'll trade Charles Clay. Let's take a look right now. Let's go best. What I'm going to do is I'm sorry, Peterman, but I'm going to... How do I, uh, that's not what I want to do. I want to, yeah, I want to put you up here, okay? Hughes, we're not going to start over McCoy, I don't think. Charles Clay, though, I kind of want to just get rid of you. What are you, 29, but he's still kind of young? Uh, da, 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 da. I, don't, I guess not. What do we have looking at linebackers right now? Do we have Burnett's definitely one we drafted, Baird's someone we drafted. Uh, we signed round when we didn't really need to. I think we're going to look pretty good. I kind of want to trade McCoy, though, but... That seems kind of foolish. Peterman, I probably should trade, but I'm not going to. All right, let's go into the season, see if they're going to put Peterman in. I don't know if they're going to. So they didn't put in Peterman, which that's good to know. So I'm going to sim right to the midseason mark. See you in a second. So at the midseason mark, we are 4-4, four and four, not too bad. Let's see what we look at in the division. Third in the division, though. Dolphins are 6-2. and two? What? Let's check out the stats for James White, who I'm assuming eight passing touchdowns, 1,500 yards, not bad. Seven interceptions, though. No, 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 no. Pete does have a touchdown. I might, I, I honestly might just bench him for this guy. I'm just, I'm just tossing that out there. Hughes has five touchdowns. McCoy has six. Tolbert has two. I feel, it's, did, did somebody get hurt? Or is, is, oh, okay. Actually, if you look right there, it seems like Hughes is getting more carries over Tolbert and over McCoy. Jones, who is Zay Jones? Has three touchdowns. Jordan Matthews with one. Clay with two. Kelvin Benjamin with one. What is going on? Where's Nick O'Leary? Nick O'Leary's not even getting playing time? Really? What is he? Is he not even number two in my, my thing? Wow, he's not even number two. Wow. I'm, I'm so surprised. I, why? Whoa, 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 whoa. He's injured. Okay, so you know what we're doing? We're putting in this guy. How long is he injured for? He's injured for three more weeks. Okay. So we're going to go with Pete. I'm not going with the Peterman. That's not happening. Let's see who's going to be a free agent. So maybe we have to re-sign someone. Kelvin Benjamin, 27. Obviously, that's just the slam dunk. We're bringing him back. Thank you. Alexander, I'm not too worried about. Mills, not too worried about. There's nobody else here. Tolbert, I don't really need you anymore, buddy. I got a bigger, stronger back. So we're going to scout some players. See you in one second. So I scouted a bunch of players. What I really like is Rodriguez right here. I like Landel. I don't know if he's really going to amount to anything. And then I like the two defensive tackles that I looked at. I don't know how far back in the draft we're going to be. We're 4-4. Four and four. Obviously, maybe we'll make the playoffs. Maybe we won't. We only have one pick this year. So, actually, no. We got two picks this year. That's right. I forgot about that. So we might have two somewhat decent picks. But let's go to the playoffs. See if we make it. So we didn't make the playoffs? Is that what I'm trying to understand here? What do we go for a record? Nine and seven, so we should have probably made it. That's so annoying. We are getting better, though. Obviously, we lost our quarterback. What, what more can I do without a quarterback? White went 15 touchdowns, 14 interceptions. Pete, I might have to start you over him. God damn it. Four touchdowns, one interception. That's pretty good. McCoy had 10 touchdowns. Hughes with 15. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Matthews, two touchdowns. Zones, or zones. Jones has six. Clay has five. Benjamin, three. O'Leary still still not there. He didn't have a single catch. Uh, not a single catch. Yearly awards. I'm kind of interested to see how this goes. MVP. Do we have anybody? Of course not. Coach of the year. There I am. Woo. Six overall. All right. We're in the AFC. So do we have anybody in the offensive player of the year? We do not. Defensive player of the year maybe? Nope. Offensive rookie. We must have someone. Hughes and White. Imagine if White actually played all the games. Like come on. Anybody else? Oh, and P. P. Wow. How many? Really? Okay. I'll take your word for it. Yes. Defensive rookie of the year in Burnett. Baird's right there too. Mahone. I'm getting better at this, guys. I'm getting better at this. That is so good. So they must have some decent amount of XP, right? See, I still, I watch people do this and they get like thousands and thousands of XP and I don't know how it happens. Oh, there's, there's one way. He has 13,000. All right. I'm going to do some XP. Upgrading stuff like that, and then I'm going to go to free agency. I'll see you in one second. So let's see who won the Super Bowl before we look at the free agency league schedule. 
Uh, da, 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 da. Super Bowl, the Falcons beat the Jaguars. I don't see that happening anytime soon. What is going on? The Patriots lost to the Chargers. The Eagles lost, uh, beat the Green Bay. Cincinnati was in the playoffs. What is going on? I don't think we have anybody else that we can sign. That like, Obviously, we have people we can sign. I don't think there's anybody I want to sign. Yeah, nobody I want to sign. So, let's see who's there for free agency. I think we took a step up. What do we want? We went 6-8-1, and, and then we went 9-7, and seven, and we lost our rookie quarterback. So, let's see if there's anybody here. What do we have for... I didn't see what... I think it said 50 million. 130... Oh, 65 million. I was like, what the hell? Okay. Um, I mean, Stefan Diggs, that'd be nice. Ingram, we're not going to do, obviously. Alex Smith, no. Is there anybody that's just like, no... See, I don't think anybody other than ooh, Wolf. I'm gonna offer you something. Yeah, we'll just give him a nice little, nice little cheap one. Maybe he'll come to the team, help us out a little bit. Obviously, we don't need that. What is that? Left end? Oh, I already offered somebody that. Okay, actually, I'm gonna have, I'm gonna offer Dig something. I don't know if you guys think that's unrealistic or anything like that, but I am going to give it a shot. Let's go up to eight five. See if that's enough. It is. Okay, it's enough. All right. I don't think there's anybody else I really want to see. Let's take another, just a nice little quick peek. Is that Roethlisberger? Did I see that? Oh, okay. That's not Roethlisberger. Rodenhauser. I just saw, I saw BR and I was like, that must be Roethlisberger. Okay. Anybody else? Yeah, nobody I really see that's good one wouldn't be that bad, but we already have some wide receivers that we, we don't really need anymore. Okay. Let's sim it to the next week. Maybe we can get Stefan Diggs. Maybe we can get Wolf. I hope we at least get one of them. Yes! We got both of them. Okay, I'm going to scout a little bit, and then I'm going to go to the draft. See you in one second. So here we are at the NFL draft. What picks do we have? It might be somewhat down there, actually. We have the 16th and the 19th. That's not too bad. That's probably, like, right about where we want to be, at least in my opinion. So let's see if any of our guys is there. I forget. There was one guy I was looking at. Is he already gone? Oh, no, no. Okay, here we go. It was either Knight. Okay, the other guy actually is gone. Okay. That's Orlando we were actually looking at, too. A special catch, catching traffic, catching. But we just got Stefan Diggs, so I don't know how we don't really need him. Do I get Knight? Uh, power moves. I don't really like him that much. How Can I make a trade? I hate that I might be trading away my draft picks in the second year. What can I get? First round next year. Anybody giving me two first rounders, maybe? Nobody? 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 No, but it's... You know what? I'm going to take that defensive tackle, and I'll regret it later, I guess is the best way to put it. Uh, da -da -da -da. Where are you, buddy? Roman Knight. See, we don't have a good defensive tackle. We do not. I'm going to take him. Good pick. Uh, slow development. No! Why, 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 why? Okay, I don't want to trade him. Why, why, why would I? Why would I be there? Oh, that other guy's still there. Do I just take him? Where there he is? I, I mean that looks really good. Red zone threat. He's 6'4", 21. I'm taking him. A good pick. He was ranked four. We took him at 19. I feel like this draft is gonna kill us. Let's see. We're in the second round. Obviously, I've been looking at centers. There's some other centers that I saw later in the draft. I believe. One of these guys is really good. I forget which one it is, though. Okay, maybe... Is it this one? Okay, maybe not. What? You know what? I'm just going to take this guy. B impact block. We're taking him. Oh, we already have another pick. Wow. Wow, woo, wee, woo. Anybody giving me a first round pick for it? Probably not. Probably not. Probably not. Nope. All right. Let's see what we have on our draft board. A left tackle. We don't really need one of those. A left guard. We do, but that's actually... Let's not do anything drastic here. About to... Ooh. See? He has good combine. Says he's a late third rounder. I'm going to pick him. Superstar development. There you go. 73 overall, which isn't that good. But superstar development. I'm going to like that a lot. Okay. We are in the third round. Pick 19. Who do I have here? Wow. All my guys are falling back. Do I just take a risk on somebody? What are you looking like? What are you looking like? Maybe. It, see, there's nobody here that really just grabs. Doesn't grab me. Nobody grabs me. Oh, can I have a defensive tackle that jumps really high? That'd be That'd be helpful. See, none of these guys have anything good really going for them. Vertical jump, that's kind of nice. No, no, no. Who do we have way up here? I don't even, I don't even need any of these positions. So what I'm going to do is I think I'm going to trade them. Who's going to give me the most for this? Who had three things? There was nobody with three? Okay, so that's a second round pick, second round pick, and a fifth. 
Second and a fifth on the Ravens. Second and a six. Four, 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 three and a six. Ah, uh, God damn it. I'll trade with the Ravens, I guess. So let's see what we can get in the fourth round. I don't think that's too early to be reaching on some of these players. Obviously, we need a left guard. So which one of these guys is better off on our team? I kind of like this guy. Are any of these guys good? I'm going to reach on Guri Guri. I don't know how to say his name. I'm sorry. Normal development. He was ranked 34, though. So with our fifth round pick, we are going to take another left guard just to play it safe. I'm getting a lot of good picks, but I don't know how many of these guys are actually going to help us. So with our sixth round pick, we are going to reach a little bit on this guy, but he has such good combine stuff. An excellent pick. I thought that would have been a reach for sure. I have a lot of confidence in that guy right there. We should have one more pick. Yes, we do. And we are just going to pick one of our guys on our draft board just to fill it out a little bit. So we just got another center? Yeah, let's just get another center. Why not? So I am trading Peterman for the Bears sixth round pick. I just wanted him off my team. I don't want him to be my backup. We have two good... I guess not rookie quarterbacks, but then their first, their second year rather. So I just wanted Peterman off the team, get rid of him. We don't need him. So this is a big, big trade. We're trading McCoy, Payne, and our second round pick for the Lions' first round pick this year coming up. I just want to get McCoy off the team. We have that first or second year running back who played so good last year. Now he'll get the majority majority of the carries. So let's just see if we can make any more trades. So this is what our lineup is going to look like. I like the way, I like what it's looking like. Just to be honest, our defense is what I'm so proud of. Why is, okay, we got Milano, Burnett. Bur okay, there's Baird. I was like, where did Baird go? I feel like we should have Moreno starting, but I'm not going to worry about it too much. I think this defense should be able to hold up. So let's sim to the midseason mark, see what happens. So at the midseason mark, we are three, four, and one. Really? That's kind of disappointing. Let's check out the stats real quick. We do have an, another season after this, so it's not the end of the world that this doesn't go well. 11 touchdowns, 9 interceptions. Come on, White. Do something for me. Hughes, I was expecting a lot out of you. Come on. Is that James White? No, that's probably our... That's that's dumb. That's our quarterback, White, not James White. Uh, see, our, none of our... I mean, I guess Benjamin's doing all right. Diggs is doing next to nothing. Glad I gave you a big contract. God damn it. All right, I'm going to scout some players and then sim to the playoffs. Hopefully, our team can turn it around. So, we didn't make the playoffs? 7 8 and 1. Woohoo! How do we. How does that happen? I promise you, Pete is starting next year unless I get someone great in the draft. I did scout some quarterbacks. Who knows what's going to happen? Let's go to the offseason. Actually, no, 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 no. Let's see who won awards real quick and our stats. I, for, I don't know why I forgot to do that. 20 touchdowns of 14 interceptions isn't terrible. I mean, it's really not. Hughes got nine touchdowns. Logan got 10. What the hell is that? Benjamin had five. Ladold, he is our rookie, got one. Clay got three. Diggs, three. Matthews, two. I mean, nothing nothing to talk about. Like, what is going on? Well, check out the awards real quick. MVP. Do we have anybody? Of course not. Coach of the year. Of course not. Let's go to the AFC. Do we have any? And nope. Defensive player of the year. Burnett. Hey, hey, hey. Look at rookie of the year, offensive rookie of the year, Landol. Not too bad that you're actually up there. Probably don't have anybody here, right? Nope. Best QB. Oh, there's Monk. We almost picked Monk. Oh, I forget the other guy. What was the other guy? Oh, Collins. I forget all about Collins. Me, I. Eh, who cares? All right, let's go to the off season. So let's see who won the Super Bowl real quick. Schedule. We are gonna sim one more season after this. Hopefully something can happen. Let's go to the Super Bowl. Steelers lost to the Seahawks 30 to 15. Ugh. What who are these teams? Jaguars, Bengals, Saints, Falcons. I guess Steelers Chargers. Ugh. Ugh, ugh, ugh. All right, let's see what we can get for free agents. Uh, maybe there'll be somebody good here. I don't know. Who do we have here? Hooper. That wouldn't be too bad. Neil, that also wouldn't be too bad. I might I might consider that. Left end. Uh, Jesus, I wouldn't even mind that. What do we have? 80 million. 80 million that wouldn't be bad but we already have some good players at that position i'm 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 going for this guy i know that for sure let's give him a five that should get us by okay maybe not let's withdraw that let's give him nine five i mean i don't know what what, what does he want no 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 there we go nine five that should be enough right no but hopefully he'll take it we have 71 million Okay, I'm taking Hooper. What is who? 89. So let's go to 7-5. Uh, 7-6. So let's do it. Oh, Charles Clay must have retired. Good, good, good. I'm taking this guy. I'm sorry, but I'm going to take him. We're going to give him. We're going to give him. We're going to give him 7 million. Okay, that is enough. 
We don't really need him, but we could put him at right end. So let's give him six. Yeah, it's six. I was gonna, I was gonna stop at five point nine for whatever reason. I'm not really sure. Anybody else that just grabs my fancy tickles my fancy? Do I just get him just, just because? Do I just sign Fuller? Maybe he'll come to the team. We have so much money, like an obnoxious amount of money. Okay, that's more. Okay, things are going swimmingly right now. Okay. Let's sim, see what happens. Or sim to the next week at least. So, Campbell rejected, Hopper accepted, Fuller rejected. Really? All those people, what? Why don't you want to be on my team? What happened? Anybody else here that I could just get just in case? No, a bunch of old guys? Uh, da, 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 do I want him? Let's try to give him a contract real quick. Let's go up to five. There we go, five million. That should be enough. Yeah, yeah, okay. Let's sim a week. I'm going to scout some players first. See you in a second. Okay, here we are at the draft. What do we have for a pick? I thought it would be some. Okay, 12, 14. I didn't know we had two. That's kind of nice. I, I probably didn't know I had two, actually. Probably should just think for a little bit, and I probably would have figured that out. Anybody that I want. Ooh, doo, 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 doo. I kind of wanted this quarterback when I was looking at him. Look at that. Look at that. Henry Donnelly. Oh, I'm going to take him. No. Probably shouldn't have done that, just being honest. feel like I'm blowing this rebuild right near the end, and it's kind of very disappointing. Do we need a right tackle? We do, but we also need a right end, right? Our right end sucks. B minus, okay? Maybe it doesn't. Let's go with the tackle. Ooh, quick development. That's actually what we needed. Okay, with that third round pick, we are taking Bowen. Uh, I thought I thought that guy would have been quick development for some reason. I guess not. Now, for some reason, we... Oh, we don't need a left outside linebacker. That's right. We signed one. We do need a left end, though. So, let's try to take this guy. See what happens. Normal development. I reached big time. So, we are... Like I said, we are starting peed. Guaranteed. Okay. Now, I am just going to sim right to the playoffs. If we don't make it, we don't make it. So, here we go. Let's go to the playoffs. So we didn't make the playoffs. How on earth did that happen? We went six, nine, and one. Really? It looks like Pete got benched, which is kind of annoying, even though I, I made him the starter, but who cares? 17 touchdowns, 17 interceptions. Uh, I thought he would have performed better. 15 touchdowns for Hughes. Like, are you kidding me? That is great. Two touchdowns, seven for Hooper. I thought he would have done so much better than this. I don't get it. Let's see at the awards, see if any of our guys got anything. I doubt it. And no, maybe. Why does that sound familiar? It's a kill coach of the year. Did we get it? <laughs> I don't know why we would get coach of the year. All right, AFC. Do we get any AFC guys on here? No defensive guys. We got Burnett. Obviously, that's like my one good pick I made in this whole thing. Reeves almost got offensive rookie of the year. Not too bad. What else do we have here? Nothing. But that is going to do it, guys. I need to figure out how to do this better. So let me know. Give me all your tips, tricks, and stuff down in the comments below. And if you like this video, give it a like down below. Make sure to check out my channel. Subscribe for daily Madden 18 content. And I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.